Hon, huh, we're heading into Aldi, so uh, what do you think? Like and subscribe. What about my quarter? I don't forget your quarter. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> let's go. You hate getting ripped off going to the grocery store? Well, of course you do. So do I. That's why today, here we are. We're at Aldi. We're going to go in here. I've been here for about five days. And uh, the last couple of videos, I mean, you saw high-priced foods. You saw Sam's with the, the really expensive mango. So uh, my wife's with me. We're going to grab a few items. So let's head in. Let's check some prices. Find some bargains. Let's have some fun. This is Saturday and someone's got their, their radio blaring here. Anyways, you have Aldi and then you have uh, homes, Home Goods over there. And then Marshall's, my wife's going to be going into that place. And uh, and she's going to drag me in there uh, uh, as well. So uh, I have my quarter here. My wife said, don't forget your quarter. So uh, let's head in here. <laughs> I'll rent our cart and uh, let's have some fun. Hon, I got the quarter here. Unless you have one. Oh, you have a quarter, hon? I know it's really cold for Florida. No, no, you have to, uh, hon, you have to, there you go. <laughs> pull, pull. All right, let's head in here. This is a brand new Aldi's. I really like this place. And um, look how beautiful it is here. I really like this Aldi's. And actually, I like Aldi's all together here. And uh, I may need to get some more potatoes, but look at the avocados here. They're 49 cents. Um, this one doesn't look good, but... I mean, 49 cents. They don't overall. They don't look bad. Mandarins, 2.99. Oh, I bet these guys are scrumptious. Someone said the New California mandarins are in, and um, I gotta, I gotta look at this stuff. I'm hungry too. Never come shopping when you're hungry, or go out. Look at the size of the lemons, 2.99. You get four of them. Some of these you get five or six. So I mean, you know, that's not too bad. I've seen them at uh, Publix for 99 cents each, which is uh, a ripoff. The sweet potatoes, 2.29. So that's <laughs> look at this; <laughs> they're sticking out of there. That's not too bad either. And what else do they have here? Oh, we need. There's the cantaloupes. Don't touch a cantaloupe. 2.89. Oh, I touch. I touched the cantaloupe. <laughs> uh, we need to um, set some things out for New Year's. My wife has a tradition. And they're $3.69 for the personal watermelon. So um, I'm afraid we're going to have to grab one. We have to, may have to grab a pineapple. They're buck eighty-five. Honeycrisp apples. Um, the dents are free. Uh, <laughs> and so are the uh, rotten parts. But uh, $1.89, you have to just, you have to find a good one. This one looks really good, but a, a buck eighty-nine. Oh, look at this Snapdragon apple totes. A buck forty-nine a pound, though. A buck forty-nine cosmic apples, three forty-nine for the whole package. That's really good. That's really good. Red delicious, three nineteen for the whole bag. For the whole bag and Granny Smith apples, three forty-nine for the whole bag. Pink ladies, three forty-nine for this or three ninety-nine for three pounds. That's a good deal. The honey crisp, three twenty-nine, and the Roma tomatoes, eighty-nine cents. They look nice. They were a little small for a while there, but these look really nice. I really like Roma tomatoes and 89 cents, anything under a dollar, I'll take. And the cherry tomatoes, $2.49. That's probably the cheapest I've seen it. Oh, organic yellow potatoes. This is a little pricey, $3.79 for this. I bet they're delicious, but almost $4? I don't think so. And $2.59 for beefsteak tomatoes. That's a little pricey. Uh, overall, this is an affordable place to shop. Gourmet medley tomatoes, $2.89. And tomatoes on the vine, $2.89 for the package. And you get six of them. And at Walmart, they were $1.98 a pound. Three green peppers here, $2.29. You have to look to make sure that they're fresh. But they're, they're not too bad, $2.29. They're about, I think they're $0.86 cents each at Walmart. And... The green skin avocados are $1.89. They're $1.89 each for these. I don't know if that's good or bad. I, I don't I don't know. <laughs> Let's look at the potatoes. And large baking potatoes, $4.19, and you get five pounds of them. And we just had potatoes. And and there's some nice ones right there. They're russets. And the red potatoes are $3.99. And I, I bought some of these. They're really good too. And here's the yellow onions, two fifteen, just like at Walmart. See, Walmart's they're the same price here, three pounds, two dollars and fifteen cents. Sweet onions are two twenty nine, and white onions, two pounds are two twenty nine. This is a bargain right here, 
and the red onions are also $2.29. $2.29 for that. But I don't think this is a bargain, but garlic is, is always expensive here. I don't know why. Ginger root, $1.99. That doesn't look too bad. And, um, oh, my wife's got some stuff. What do you have, hon? Oh, the personal watermelon, an expensive pomegranate, and um, a bag of lemons. <laughs> what? Oh, you're going with the marshals. Okay, thanks, hon. All right. That's all you need? Okay. All right. See ya. My wife's going with the marshals. Oh, jeez. And, um, oh, here's the russet potatoes. three ninety nine. dollars and look at the size of the guys now. I'm touching it because uh, they were loose, but look at the size of this potato. Look at this. That's a pound and a half potato there. Holy smolies, $3.99, and you get, you get 10 pounds. 10 pounds, what a bargain. I recommend this, and here's the celery. 95 cents, 95 cents. I know it's not refrigerated, but uh, they turn it over really fast here. Bite-sized medley potatoes. These, these are delicious, I've had them before. But $3.29 for this package, or 10 pounds of that for $3.99. I'm going with the big bag and I still have some at home. Here's the iceberg lettuce, $1.69. It's not too bad. Uh, look at this, a little, little head, but you know, buck sixty-nine. I've seen it cheaper here. Cabbage is 85 cents, not refrigerated. And so the outside's a little bit soft, but it's okay. Spaghetti squash, $1.25 per pound. And butternut squash, $1.25 20, per pound. Yellow squash, $1.45 a pound. And the zucchini is $1.45 a pound. Doesn't look too bad. Now here's these mandarins right here, $2.99. These, these look good. And these are the little bite-sized ones. Uh, produce USA. I'd like to find out if they're from California, but $2.99 is not too bad. I like that. And oh, these must be the seedless lemons. Seedless lemons. Oh my gosh, that's GMO. I'm glad she didn't buy the seedless lemons. They're $2.29. Oh, that's what my wife bought right here. $2.99. Oh, she got some nice ones here. $2.99. And the pomegranate she got. Oh, geez, these are sad looking things. $1.69. Cara Cara oranges are $4.49 for these. Cara Cara. Sweet and seedless. So, oh, the GMO. Oh, geez. Bio uh, engineered stuff. Limes are $2.45. Limes, I don't know why they're so high. And the 57 cents for the bananas a pound. Not too bad. Let's check out some of the peanuts here. They have a lot of them here. Uh, dry roasted peanuts with sea salt. Uh, $2.29. They have it without salt and with salt right here. And what else do they have? These these assorted nuts right here. $12.99. This is about the same price of uh, Sam's. I want to get some bread here. It's a little crowded here, believe it or not. And uh, the Saturday before New Year's. But the split top uh, wheat bread is $1.25. $1.25 for the split top wheat bread right here. It does not look bad at all. And the white bread is $1.29 right there, which I bought a lot of that. Oh, the brioche is $3.99 for the buns. I'm getting pushed to the side here. $3.99 for the sesame seed brioche. And the, the actual, they have a sale. $3.19 for the brioche hot dog buns. The cheapest I've ever seen them. These are really light. Nine ounces, they just seem lighter, but $3.19. Let's go back and look at the other breads they have here. Split top wheat. I just put that in the cart. Honey wheat, a buck seventy-five. I bought this before. My wife actually liked it, but I think this is a real good bargain. One hundred percent wheat bread right here, two thirty-nine. This is really good. This looks really good. Whole grain. Then they have the twelve grain, just like the Pepperidge Farm, but without the Pepperidge Farm price. This is two dollars and thirty-nine cents. And what else is this? Oh, the whole wheat, buck eighty-five. And what else is this? 40 calorie, loving, loving fresh, $1.95. 40 calories per slice. I think what they do is they just slice them thinner. <laughs> and then they're then they're they're less calories per slice. But anyways, a buck ninety-five. The bread here, this I think this 12 grain, that's a heck of a deal right here. $239. And it's uh 24, that's a 24-ounce loaf. Each one of these are 24-ounce loaves. I'm really impressed with Aldi bread. 
Now the one item I did come in here for are the the peppers and they're they're in the back again here these uh, deli sliced mild banana pepper rings and these are better than the uh, Mount Olive 16 ounces 229 the same price Mount Olive is 12 ounces so I buy these I have I have one in the refrigerator at work and they're just delicious I have them with my uh, sandwiches well what are these sweet bread and butter pickles right here uh, 219 for that and this big container here is 239 for the Great Gherkins hamburger dill chips 32 ounces is two dollars and 35 cents artichoke carts regular 259 these are these are 219 now that's not bad at all and these olives here still a dollar 59 and the Kalamata olives here if I pronounced it right 209 that's a deal right there because those are expensive but 209 what a deal now I wanted to get some mustard here and I wanted to get some Dijon mustard and let me see the red label is spicy brown mustard and it's a it's a dollar 25 and that's what I'm gonna get and the regular mustard this is 95 cents right here and the ketchup here organic ketchup right here is a dollar 95 for the organic what a deal and the regular ketchup this is this is a dollar 85 Look at how much you get just for one. What a bargain. And uh, Sweet Baby Ray's is $2.98, so comparably priced because you're buying name brand. And Duke's Mayonnaise, still, this isn't bad for uh, Aldi, $4.64. That's not too bad. There's a lot of people in here today. Teriyaki stir fry, oh, it's, it's holding this whole thing up. See that? I better move it over. It's like a column right there, $2.19. Berman's soy sauce right here reduced reduced um, sodium a buck fifty five that's a bargain right there let's check something a little bit different because it's busy over there paper towels five seventy five oh my gosh why and uh, paper plates five five ninety nine well, I don't know why this stuff is so expensive and um, two rolls five seventy five now if you come over here you get two rolls right here is 269 but these are light as a feather um, paper plates here this is six dollars and nine cents I don't know why that is but uh, it just is and, and napkins here 250 of them a buck 95 now here is a whole thing of paper towels and it's thirteen dollars and fifteen cents called Boulder Ultra they don't seem too bad and here's some classic six pack of paper towels 689 so you're talking about what maybe a dollar 15 um, each dollar 20 but uh, 689 for that then right across the street on the aisle we see the toilet paper <laughs> you know it costs a lot of money to wipe your butt these days but ten dollars and 25 cents and you can do this for a couple of weeks <laughs> it's a family size and here's the like scott tissue thousand sheet uh, per roll 829 for that 829 and here's some so soft 549 so soft not too bad premium so soft two ply six or not six 549 it's on sale not too bad I don't think this is too bad at all and this is all they have for detergent here and it's a small thing of Tide and I think it's comparable 12, uh, 1297 and some of this whether whatever this is off-brand 649 and here's another off-brand. Oh, that's tied. It's in the wrong spot. There it is, Tandil, seven forty-nine. And your fabric softener, oh, Gain, a name brand, ten thirty-nine. And then your off-brand, seven nineteen for that stuff. And OxyClean right there is ten ninety-nine. I don't use it, so I don't know if that's a good price or not. Don't know. OxyClean spray, three fifteen. I bet that's cheaper than Walmart, though. I just bet it is. Let's look at some of the noodles here, and these are really good, these yakisobas. And just add water and put it in a microwave, 80, look at 85, 89 cents. These, these are really good if you've never tried them. They're fantastic. And look at the uh, instant lunch, 245 for this right here. I don't think that's too bad. And what else do they have? This is really salty. I don't recommend it. Campbell's Chunky Chicken Noodle Soup, 226. They're all 226. Oh, steak and potato. 
steak and potato. I used to take this camping because look at it. You just pull a uh, pull top on it, and this is um, one pound, two ounces, two twenty six. I wonder what that is at Publix or Walmart, but here it's two twenty six at Aldi. All their eight ounce cheeses here in the packages are a dollar ninety nine. Monterey Jack, the Colby's a buck buck ninety nine. The mozzarella, the and it's Wisconsin extra sharp cheddar right here. It's a dollar ninety nine, and their bags of it are two forty nine. Finely shredded, twelve ounces, two forty nine. That's not too bad. Craft singles, a dollar eighty nine, right here. And then if you go to the name brand, craft craft singles, crafts craft singles, <laughs> four dollars and ninety eight cents. I think I had it right in the first place. Four ninety eight. See off-brand name brand I know you get more but you're paying more five dollars for that a dollar eighty nine for that let's check some of the meat prices here six seventy nine for top round black Angus round steak six seventy nine beef is just not cheap anywhere terrific for tacos six twenty nine a pound and it's 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 really messy here today so let's see if I can find anything marked right Here's some hamburger, a pound of it, $5.69 a pound. Here's some 96% lean, $5.99. Ground beef here, grass-fed, organic, $5.19, not bad at all. Uh, pork center-cut loin filet, $2.99 a pound. So that's not too bad, it's marinated. And what's half-butt pork roast, $2.99 a pound, $12.68 for this. I'd go to Walmart and their pork chops, $3.99 a pound. Uh, not, that's not a good price. But like I said, uh, pork here and beef, $3.39 a pound for just your utility cut of pork. That's not a good price. And here's something, $4.69 a pound. Don't fall, don't fall, guy. Uh, for this thin sliced center cut pork chops, $3.94. So uh, it's not the best price, like I said. It's hard to get away from high uh, beef prices or pork, but if you go to Sam's or Costco, you're going to save some money. And they have all the seafood here. I've looked at these before. They're all right around $9 a pound. $9 a pound. And steelhead trout right here, $11.29 a pound right there. That looks really good with the skin on. Look at that. That's beautiful. I like that. Pacific cod, $9.99 a pound. This one piece right here is $5.39. So, uh, that's not too bad. It looks good. Oh my gosh, the stuff is falling. I better get it. Let's check some of the snacks here. Uh, puffed corn, butter. Oh, this is as light as a feather here. Five ounces, and it's it's two twenty nine. And this variety pack is nine eighty eight. Of course, it's it's branded. It's not the Clancy Doritos or four forty eight. Four forty eight for this little bag. Nine ounces. See, it's branded four forty eight. And here's something nacho stuff. Doesn't look the best, but it's Clancy's tortilla chips, half the price, two thirty-nine. Cheese puffs, two nineteen, right here. Clancy's cheese puffs, two nineteen, right there. Oh, here's the cheese curls. I've never tried these. They don't look too bad. Two dollars made with real cheese. I'm impressed. Two dollars and nineteen cents. Clancy's kettle chips not oh here's some wavy stuff nothing's in the right spot but 219 for the wavy potato chips and the barbecued 219 then you go to the Frito scoops 448 nine ounces anytime you you get name brand stuff you're paying for you're paying for it right there and here's corn chips Clancy's Clancy's a dollar 79 Fritos 448 that's what you're paying for. And your Pringles, $2.89. You're paying for the name. Bursting with flavor, bursting with expensiveness. And the off brand here called Clancy Stackers are $1.69. So there's your difference. I know you get a little more in there, but still you're paying a lot more. Let's check the eggs here. They're $1.81. $1.81 a dozen for the eggs now, for the large. And um, there they are. That's missing, so you don't get a full dozen in that one. And then the milk is, oh, I better close the door. <laughs> $2.82 uh, $2 for the whole milk. And for the 2%, same price, $2.82. And if you want a half gallon, 
It's a it's a dollar seventy one right there. And I I've, I've come in here and I bought a half gallon when I went to Publix and bought some of the bakery cookies. I know I shouldn't be shopping at Publix; it's expensive, but they make really good cookies. But a buck seventy one for the half gallon. And here's some of your brown eggs right here, the organic. They're a little more, but not much more. Your uh, large brown eggs here are two fifty eight. Well, they have they have them taped. In your organic eggs, three ninety three a dozen right there. And looks like they've sold out of some of these guys. Whipping cream, four sixty nine for that. And here's some of your whip topping. Oh, two ninety nine. Stuff's expensive. Two ninety nine for that. Let's check some of their orange juice because I notice it's gone up at Walmart. And a gallon here is six thirty five. Six thirty five. And I think it was six seventy nine or six eighty nine at Walmart. And this stuff here with pineapple orange juice, three thirty nine. And here's just your pulp free orange juice. 329 right there and here's some high pulp orange juice doesn't look bad see that look at this oh that looks good three dollars and 29 cents and here's some no pulp up there 50 calorie oh geez oh what is this not from concentrate organic 539 don't get that get the stuff here and here's your coke products the two liters regular 268 now they're now they're a dollar 96 and your 12 packs are they're six forty-eight. Here's your water, seven fifty, seven, seven forty-nine. I, I zoomed in on it. Oh, it's fruit-flavored water. Unbelievable. And this stuff is three dollars and fifty-nine cents. Look at this little tiny. This is three dollars and fifty-nine cents for that. They're called Juniors, twenty-four pack, ten ounces. Unbelievable pricing on the water here. And this water is three eighty-nine for a twenty-four pack really pricey water has gone way up I wanted to look at some of their food in the cooler here spiral sliced half ham is a dollar ninety nine a pound for this stuff right here and it doesn't look too bad let me look at this stuff a spiral sliced hickory honey ham Appleton Farms this doesn't look bad and here's some of your uh, honey gram a uh, honey glaze stuff right here and this whole ham is twenty dollars and it's a ten, 10 pound ham this doesn't look bad at all. None of this stuff doesn't look bad. Actually, it's pretty decent. $20 for, for your ham is an average price. Looks really good. That's not too bad. And they have some duck over here. Here's some duck. Where's the duck? Uh, $25 for a duck, and it's $3.69 a pound. They're frozen like a rock. I could just look at that. That's, that's frozen right there. <laughs> and what is this? Turkey breast. $3.99 a pound for the, for the frozen turkey breast. It's always pricey. Chicken sticks. Look at that, like little legs or something. And these are $9.99 for that. Called Kirk. Three pounds are called Kirk Kirkwood. They're trying to imitate um, um, uh, Costco with Kirkland. Here's taquitas, $4.99 for a one pound, four ounce package of them. I do like taquitas. Yummy hot chicken breast fries. Three and a half pounds is $10.99 for this box hot chicken breast fries that's a that's a big thick packet this is heavy this is a heavy monster right here it says yummy fun nutritious and delicious I, I don't even want to look at the ingredients but uh, chicken breast fries 10.99 for three and a half pounds there you go so that's everything I got right there and uh, you can see the uh, the personal watermelon the uh, the lemons and the pomegranate spicy brown mustard and the uh, the wheat bread and the pomegranate and, oh, and the banana pepper rings, and that came to $13.26. And uh, they don't give you bags here unless you buy them, and they're $0.12 cents each. So uh, we're going to be heading out here. It was really busy in there. Holy smolies. Well, that's going to wrap up the shopping trip here at Aldi. <laughs> you saw my wife there. Now she's over at Marshall's shop. And anyways, I spent $13.26. We got what we wanted. I really like shopping at Aldi. The meats are always going to be expensive. The bacon, I didn't even get, I couldn't even get near the aisle, but there was everything was four dollars a pound for the bacon, and I and you saw the produce. A lot of the produce to me looks really good. I really like the celery stalks. They're under a dollar. I mean, try and find that somewhere else. I mean, you have to shop around if you want to save money, and that's what I do. And I know everybody else does too because we're just tired of getting ripped off. So. I hope everybody enjoyed the shopping trip at Aldi here, so give me a thumbs up for like. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Until next time, this is Scott with The Real Economy. We'll see ya.